Hello everybody, my name is Washington Washira. I am a birder based in Kenya. Today I want to talk to you about the birds of Africa. So the birds of Africa application is something you can download on your phone uh, and you're able to use that for birding. For example here I've been looking at superb starlings and if I come to my phone I can simply search superb and that gives me the option to be able to see all the birds with the name superb and by scrolling here you can see them all so what I'm looking for is the superb starling so if I click there it gives me different options uh, you can select the map and see where the species is distributed across Africa uh, you can also click on the information and there it gives you a photo uh, sometimes one sometimes several photos of the species then you can go to the next chapter which is information gives you a lot of information about the species how to identify the species males females young ones immatures and juveniles uh, whether there's some subspecies that you should consider uh, description of sound or voices general habits of the species you can come and see the status and distribution and then the reference page on the birds of africa book and this is really nice because you can go back to the big book uh, the birds of africa the different volumes and go straight on to the page where your species is another really good feature is i can be able to compare with different species that look the same you click the similar tab and it gives you two other species that look like a superb starling so here we have the hildebrand starling and the shelly uh, starling which are also closely related to the superb starling and from that you can learn more because the application is supposed to increase your learning and you can get to know more species uh, by looking at the comparisons and again the map feature is still there and you can go back to the map as well the app also has very good sounds you're able to actually practice your sounds and know which birds are calling whenever you're out there in the field hello everyone my name is alex mwangi i'm a birder from mount kenya my name is diana from south nandi forest a birder with kenya women birders my name is Rafik Safari. I'm a bird watcher in the coastal area. My name is Jackson. I come from uh, Laikipia area. I'm a bird watcher. My name is Norman Kiboy. I come from Nakuru, that is in the central rift valley of Kenya. I am a bird watcher. My name is uh, Leonard Korir from uh, South Rift, a place uh, called uh, Masai Mara. My name is Francis Kamuero from Laikipia, um, northern side of the country. I am Benson Aingwa, I'm a Bada. My name is Martin Wanjohi, I'm a Bada from Nyeri, Kenya. My name is Jack Hiro, I'm a Bada and uh, from Kinangop, Kenya. Hello, my name is Esther Tieno, I'm a member of Kenya Women Badas. My name is Emma Sansagui and I'm a Bada from Kenya, Laikipia. My name is Simon, I am a Bada from Central Kenya in Kinangop. I'm Francis uh, Cherutich from Lake Baringo. <music> I downloaded the app uh, Birds of Africa and it is really helpful to me. And I've used the Birds of Africa application. I love the information that is in it, especially the, the explanation between the genders and distinction of it. And the sounds and the images are perfectly visible. And I like the app because of the voices are very clear, the calls are very Clear. One thing that I like about it is its clarity, especially when it comes to the information about the birds. A good example is a bird that comes from Mount Kenya, which is an East African endemic. I was looking up at the Hat Labs Turaco. I looked it at the app and realized that things like the distribution, uh, the information about the identification, it made it very easy for me to understand, learning about the calls, and also appreciating the beauty of that bird in Mount Kenya. Nice information and good pictures and sound. I've downloaded the Birds of Africa app and it is a nice application. One thing I love about it is the clarity of the images. The information is very wide in terms of uh, describing the birds, habitat and distribution. The voices are also nice, they are very clear and uh, I think they represent the real uh, voices of the birds in the wild. I love uh, calls and also photos 
and it has been very fantastic to me because of the photos it has a very clear photo and a good information about the, the distribution of birds across the country it's really of help especially when it comes to the photos that they are uploaded in there and also the sound recordings it's a good app because it uh, has a lot of information and also good pictures i like it it has a nice uh, call and beautiful pictures i enjoy the glossary it has a stock of uh, good definition of terms and uh, terminologies that you get to use in the field or when you are using the guidebooks since i downloaded i enjoy it uh, birds image also it's good and the bird score it's really nice and i love it it's a wonderful app i would really uh, encourage everyone to use it and you're going to benefit thank you so much